Welcome back to the news. We now welcome back Paso health workers and educators, Nancy Quezada Rodriguez and Yehida Bennett. Amigas, welcome back. Como esta? Muy bien. Gracias, <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> Gracias. Uh, amigas, tell us what's new with PASOS. Well, um, right now we have a new project that we're piloting. Uh, it's a three-year three uh, project. We're on year two, um, addressing child obesity. We call it Pasitos Adelante, which would be little steps moving forward. So who is your target audience for this new program? Well, since we work with the Latino community, we are focusing on Latino children from zero to five and who's pediatrician at Beaufort Jasper Hampton Comprehensive Health Services, um, sends us a referral um, from ages zero to five and they have a high BMI and are at risk. And so what happens is that they choose a goal from a toolkit, the 5210, and, um, which means five servings of fruits and vegetables, two hours or less of screen time, one um, hour of minimum physical activity, zero sugary drinks, and we do home visits and we help them um, with that goal that they've chosen, we help them accomplish that goal. All right, I like it. Good outcomes based on choices. Obesity is a national epidemic. Why have you chosen to focus on the youngest children in our, in our community? Well, because small children are very vulnerable, especially because they depend on their parents when it comes to eating. And so it is important that um, parents, well, especially mothers, um, when they are pregnant, they begin to eat, um, eat healthy. And so nutrition starts before um, a child is born. So we focus on the first years of development in order to prevent any health issues um, in the future. So we hope that if this program, this initiative, once it's well polished, it can be replicated statewide. Yeah, when you're a kid, nothing beats home cooking. Uh, when you get a little bit older, you certainly miss it. What are your best recommendations for moms looking to keep their kids healthy? Well, um, like we said before, uh, really um, childhood obesity can be prevented before. So then for moms and also for fathers, uh, we recommend that before they decide that they want to be pregnant, uh, to start eating healthy, adopt a healthy lifestyle, eat healthy and balanced meals, drink plenty of uh, water, um, ad adopt or include physical activity in your daily routine, take a multivitamin with folic acid every day, uh, do not consume alcohol, um, drugs, or smoking cigarettes, and also during pregnancy to have prenatal care and plan to breastfeed your child uh, once the baby is born, exclusively breastfeeding for at least six months. And that's another thing that we're doing. We're promoting breastfeeding because if uh, breastfed children are, for the most part, less likely to be overweight and obese uh, when they are adults. Well, wonderful. Keep up the good work, ladies. Yahira Benet and, uh, excuse me, Bennett and Nancy Cazada Rodriguez are with PASOS of Beaufort and Jasper County. Amigas, thank you so much for coming on today. Thank you. Thank you again, <laughs> Kevin, for having us over. Have a wonderful day. You too. It's my pleasure. Muchas gracias.